engineering study materials. Today we are going to discuss about the annealing process. Actually it is a heat treatment process in which the ductility and reducing the hardness can be done in this process. So in this process the metal is heated to a temperature above its recrystallization temperature and keeping at the same temperature for some time that is the soaking time for the homogenization of the metal. So what is the homogenization means making a uniform microstructure of the metal so that a soaking time is important for this process and followed by a very slow cooling in a furnace to develop the equilibrium structure in a metal or an alloy. So the steel is heated to a 30 to 50 degree Celsius above the AE3 temperature in case of the hypoeutectoid and 30 to 50 degree Celsius above the A1 temperature in case of the hypereutectoid as we see in this diagram AE1 and AE3. Then the cooling is actually done in a furnace itself. This is a furnace cooling method. So what are the aims that is what we get by the use of annealing process we can able to increase the ductility of the metal and reducing the hardness improving the formability and recrystallize the cold work metals that is the strain hardened metals and remove the internal stresses it is the major um, advantage in this process to remove the internal stresses and increase the toughness as we are increasing the, the ductility, we can able to increase the toughness and decrease the brittleness and increasing the machinability and decreasing the elastical resistance and improving the magnetic properties. So there are the different types of annealing, hole annealing, stress relief annealing, process annealing, speed reducing annealing. So we can able to um, make the metals a more stress free, uh, make a ductile and a hardness by using this process. So this is a short video about the annealing and the types of annealing. In the further videos, we want to discuss about the types of annealing. So this is a short video friends. If you like this video, please click the thumbs up button and share this video to your friends to gain knowledge. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more videos. So thank you for watching.